A bipartisan congressional memo released Monday warns the government is failing to counter the Chinese Communist Party's espionage and propaganda efforts here in the U.S. The National Desk, Samira David, has the latest. A memo released by the House Select Committee on the Chinese Communist Party details the influence operations of the CCP in the U.S. It's called United Front Work and something Chinese President Xi Jinping is said to call a magic weapon. That work is a blend of engagement, influence activities and intelligence operations that the CCP uses to shape its political environment, including to influence other countries' policy toward the PRC and gain access to advanced foreign and technology, all in order to influence universities, think tanks, and public opinion. It's time that we pay attention to our own backyard. Uh, for a while, we just got complacent. The CCP is now exploiting that complacency in order to encroach on our territory, in my view, as part of an effort to undermine America and displace us as the global leader. Examples of that effort include $17 million donated to K-12 through schools, according to a report by the group Parents Defending Education. And FBI Director Christopher Wray recently warned that Chinese spies is resulting in the widespread theft of American intellectual property. That means American jobs, American families, American livelihoods directly impacted by that theft. It has flesh and blood, kitchen table consequences. Meanwhile, U.S. Customs and Border Protection reporting more than 24,000 Chinese citizens were apprehended crossing the southern border in fiscal year 2023, more than 12 times what was seen in 2022. President Biden recently met with the president of China, and this wasn't even mentioned. But what we do know is China poses a global threat. China poses one of, if not the largest threats to our own homeland. On Thursday, the House Select Committee on the Chinese Communist Party will hold a hearing focusing on the CCP's strategy to shape the global information space. I'm Amira David reporting.